US Canada Green Cities Index is an index that is comparing cities, 27 of them, in the United States and Canada on certain environmental indicators. So this is really about the environmental performance and the environmental outlook of a city. It is a great honor for San Francisco. Uh, the greenest city in North America is fantastic and it takes a lot uh, to earn this. 82% of Americans now live in cities and that number is expected to rise. As this happens, our aging infrastructure will reach its breaking point. The goal of the Green Cities Index is to identify best practices and advance good ideas. 77% of all of our garbage is diverted from the landfill. That's the highest for any large metropolitan city in the country. We're really proud of the work that we've done with our partners in Parks and Recreation to be planting a million trees in the metropolitan area by 2025. Our vision for sustainability in Washington, D.C. is to build on the great success that we've had so far. Our biggest challenges are how can we become even more energy efficient and how can we be more accepting of the water that nature provides to us naturally. Studies like this are really important because it helps to show to other cities, show our residents that this is not just talk, that we're actually fundamentally changing the way the city government does business. And the fact that we have numbers to back it up, especially numbers that are from well-respected institutions like the Economist Intelligence Unit, as well as Siemens, really becomes meaningful to others. Honestly, measurement often leads to better management and to better understanding too, credibility. That there's a lot of investment going on here and there are a lot of people that are invested in the results and so it's always very helpful to have a way of measuring our progress, measuring the results of the investments we get and as we find out that this really does make sense in terms of cost and benefit uh, then it really moves this sustainability effort forward. We've seen some commonalities with respect to the cities who seem to be faring very well. They have policies, often also have sustainability offices. We've also seen that a lot of cities that have a comprehensive approach to sustainability, it's about livability, it's about the health of the citizens, it's certainly about economic growth and economic sustainability. I think cities and states are really leading the way. The mayors and governors of cities and states around the country are really acting as CEOs, really addressing the sustainability challenges they have. And this is really where the rubber hits the road. The sustainability efforts that we're seeing at the local level are having a real impact in creating the cities of the future.